All the eyes in the world are suddenly on the country of Colombia. Why is that? Well, because apparently there's some horrible conditions going on in Colombia. And to me, they are extremely vague. Uh, it seems like the best information I can get is that in Colombia, it's just like a teensy bit too hot. Uh, not any kind of crazy storms. Uh, nothing terribly life-threatening, but it's getting a little bit too hot over there. And now suddenly it's the talk of the town. Including some people who fully deny that any, uh, what is the word, uh, meteorological, meteorological, <laughs> I can't think of the word, but stuff related to weather, any uh, wacky event is happening over there. Lots of news sources are saying that that's completely fake. Um, I'm actually in a unique position though because I have the ability to either confirm or deny it because I have a friend who lives uh, over here in the Northwest that actually if you just get on a boat and take a little bit of a sail uh, you get to Columbia pretty quickly. You may not have known that about geography but that's a fact. Uh, so I go over to my friend's house and I ask to borrow their boat and they're like oh you want to take it to Columbia? Yeah sure go ahead and take it. Um, so we, we get out the boat we get on the water. I believe that it's me and uh, my mom uh, so we're sailing across the water, and while I'm on the way there, I want to look up a couple of, um, you know, other sources, see what other people are saying about the mild hotness going on in Colombia. And one of the ones I look up is a song reviewer I like. Uh, his name's actually Todd in the Shadows, and he talks about how uh, somebody is going to make a charity single about this and he just knows it and he knows that it's going to be terrible. It's going to be riddled with celebrities all singing about how we got to lower the temperature in Colombia and um, you know when that happens uh, he's going to feel like then it's officially a hopeless problem because then it's a serious problem that has this awful stamp of a terrible song on it. Uh, and then somebody replies to him by asking, have you ever heard of this song, which is a, a celebrity song, another charity song, wherein they, they sing about underprivileged dogs. It's basically like the Sarah McLachlan commercials, um, but it's a rap song. It's a, and I, I wish that, I don't think I ever even listened to the song. I wish that I could have come out of this dream with some amazing, you know, song to share with all my friends that the universe just gave me about underprivileged dogs. But no, I get this, I see that this song exists, and, um, you know, that's when I confirm, yeah, the the song is probably going to be a failure at what it wants to do, because there, that song came out, and it didn't end all the dog abuse out there. So, um, now I'm pretty sure that Columbia is hopeless, if indeed it is a little bit too hot. And, you know something? I don't think that we ever actually reached Columbia to confirm that. But at one point, I did dip my hand in the water when we were kind of close to Columbia, and I said, doesn't feel that hot to me.